Hi, this is Jim Feist in Las Vegas. And we're going to start with the NFC East. Last year, we called them the NFC Least. And of course, we're talking about Dallas and Washington and the Giants and, of course, the Eagles. I'm not too sure they're still not the least because I'm not super impressed with, well, especially the Eagles. And I'm not very impressed either with the Giants. Now, I can make a case for Washington and Dallas. So let me start there. Washington, new quarterback, kind of a, a retread, been around a long time, but he's had moments and flashes of brilliance and other times just absolutely horrible. But Ryan Fitzpatrick um, has had moments, and last year he had some great moments with Miami, but he's new now to Washington, and he has a lot of weapons in Washington. Ron Rivera is a very good head coach. They got some skill players, and they've added a few extra. Ryan can get the job done. He knows how to win, and he can be brilliant at times. But their defense is definitely the best defense in this division. We're talking about winning a division here because you can get in the playoffs just by winning a division, or, of course, if you can win enough games and come second, in your division, you can also get into the playoffs. Remember, we are playing 17 games this year, so there will be another playoff spot available. But here's what we're talking about. We're talking about Dak Prescott in Dallas. Jerry Jones, of course, is the owner, general manager, and I'd say a little too interfering for me, but he does have an ability to make a lot of money, and he has the most popular franchise in the in the game. They call it America's Team. I don't know why they haven't been to the Super Bowl in like three decades, or, or darn near that many. But when it comes down to head coaches, Ron Rivera, Mike McCarthy, I prefer Rivera. McCarthy, when he was with Green Bay, he had... Brett Favre, and Aaron Rodgers. Now, you really can't do much better than that. Really quality quarterbacks. But I don't feel like Mike did a great job with that much talent. And I don't feel like he looks like he's going to do much better with Dallas. I mean, Dak Prescott is still, you know, still has a lot to prove. He comes off an injury. I like him. I like his talent. Um, but, you know, but he has to show it for a full 17 games, or at least a major part of 17 games. But the Dallas Cowboys really suffer on the defensive end. Washington is much stronger defensively and at least equal offensively. So when I look at these two teams, I like Washington to win this division Dallas to come second, Giants third, and the Eagles fourth. Now, you know, you, I'm not really going to get excited about it because I don't think any one of these four teams is a Super Bowl quality team. But one of them will win the division. One of them will get into the playoffs. And you never know, with injuries, and et cetera, et cetera, throughout the NFC, they could get two into the playoffs. But uh, for now, I'm going to go with Washington, close second Dallas, then behind them the Giants and the Eagles, and you can flip-flop them whatever way you like.